Does VPN actually change your IP location? Is VPN free to use on iPhone? Can you prevent viruses and malware by using a VPN? If you have these questions, then you are at the right place. So let's dive in, shall we? There are a huge number of VPN apps available today and to be clear, I'm not going to compare expensive VPN apps and tell you which to use. I would rather show you how to use VPN on your iPhone for free and get almost everything you need from a VPN. So basically the VPN I use for my day to day life is VPN Super Unlimited and unlike other VPN apps which have a paid version only and they give you a trial period of 7 days to use it for free, this app can actually be used for free. But how is it completely free you may ask. So there is a catch. You will have to deal with annoying ads every time you enable VPN on your iPhone. It's still better than paying around $25 to $30 every month. Right? I do have a workaround for the ads. Stay tuned till the end for that. So VPN basically changes your IP location to some other country. Like if I turn on VPN, let's go to locations and choose New York for example. And just like that, I am in New York. But keep in mind that this will only prevent ISP, that is your internet service providers to track your activity. And it will not stop hackers from hacking. So VPN doesn't protect your device from viruses or malware. Those are antivirus apps, in case you were wondering. Once you download and install the app, it will ask you to purchase a subscription first. Don't fall for that, just cancel it from here and you should be good to go. Then give VPN permission to access. You will need to put your iPhone's password to give access. And unless you are a software geek, I highly recommend to let auto mode be enabled and not to select any other options from here. Moving on, if VPN cannot save me from hackers, so my card details I use for shopping or my personal details I put on the websites might get leaked despite using VPN, right? Well, you must have noticed this lock on almost every website you visit on Safari. The website you are entering your details on must be highly guarded as it is. But this extra feature on iOS encrypts your data further. So with or without VPN, you should be safe in this regards. Now as an addition to securing your privacy, VPN also lets you access content that is not available in your country. For instance, this show is only available in the States. And even if I search for this, nada, it doesn't show up. So turn on VPN, select any straight from USA. And now let's search again. And boom, now Netflix and chill. The paid VPN definitely will give you faster speeds, but in my experience of using free VPN versions from quite some time now, I feel it does not make that big a difference. I mean, if you have extra bucks to spare, then go for the paid one, otherwise free will just do fine. Finally, let's talk about the Siri shortcut. I will leave a link for the shortcut as well as the VPN in the description below. You can assign this shortcut to backtap or leave it at your home screen for easy access. Just run the shortcut, select immediate toggle here and select the VPN we have installed. And voila, your VPN should turn on directly without having to go to the app. You can try turning on VPN from settings as well. Go to where it says VPN and try turning it on. Most probably it will not work because it only works in the paid version. But Siri shortcut will do the trick. Really strange but good for us. So that was all about VPN. Subscribe if you haven't already. Like this video and watch these videos for some absolutely life saving Siri shortcuts. Thanks for watching. My name is Mufaddal. This is Apple Vibes. Take care and I will see you in the next video.